And now we have the last property or the derivative of a constant function. So what we're going to try to prove is that the derivative of a constant c is equal to 0. So like we have for the previous properties, first we're going to rewrite this as, well, using the limit definition of a derivative. So the limit as x approaches, the limit as the change in x approaches 0 for the function f of x plus change in x minus f of x all over change in x. So as you may recall, for the constant function, no matter what x value you, you put into the function, you always get your constant. So you have constant minus constant all over change in x, which is equal to 0. Simple proof. Yay!